There are many in the world who are very concerned that this agreement does actually undermine, if not breach, the non-proliferation treaty. And could the Minister assure us that this will be kept constantly under review and will be reported to the NPT review conference when it comes along? Could he also explain what the longer term implications of this are in stoking up a Cold War with China, likely to increase defence expenditure by UK, US, Australia and China in the future, leading to greater danger in the South China Sea. What aspiration does he have for a more peaceful relationship in the long term, which will actually not cost such a vast amount of money to all the countries concerned?